Hey everyone, Jason here, and today I'm going to be reviewing this Wheeling and Lake Erie GP38 locomotive from MTH. This locomotive was released uh, just recently by MTH, and from my understanding, it is the first modern diesel that MTH has released with the Wheeling and Lake Erie paint scheme. Now, if you're from Ohio, you're probably familiar with Wheeling and Lake Erie, and if you're not, then this might be a unique rail name that you've never seen before, but this is a locomotive that is out there and operating today. I'm going to start with the front of this locomotive. If we look at all of the different details, we have a fixed bell like it would be in real life. We have separately applied handrails and ladders going up to the roof of the locomotive. There's a cab figure. These mirrors do you adjust back and forth. We have a chain right here and one of the cool features that I haven't seen on MTH locomotives yet until now is this plate right here adjusts up and down so it can fold up like that and fold back down like that if say the engineer was walking from locomotive to locomotive. The rear of this locomotive is just as detailed. We have that plate that moves up and down, another separately applied chain. We have the coupler cut bar, which adjusts up and down. And then the trucks here are loaded with detail as well. We have separately applied detail up in here. And I, I really like the way that the back of this locomotive looks with the black and orange stripes there. I think it's really cool. Looking at the side of the locomotive, we can see that real cool Wheeling and Lake Erie logo. All of these walkways do have tread. And now if you wanted to operate this in conventional mode, the controls to that are located on top. This is held in by magnets. And there are two switches on top. And there are the smoke and volume controls. Now I don't have any use for that because I run DCS. But if you were to run it conventionally, that's where the controls would be located. Okay, next I'm going to move this onto the main line and pull a few cars and uh, hope you guys enjoy.
All right, that about does it for this review. Thanks for watching.